Many Tunisian Muslims are complaining they can no longer afford buying sheep for sacrifice, whereas consumption of traditional sweets has fallen as an economic crunch and high prices prevent customers from splashing out on food ahead of Eid al adha or Feast of Sacrifice, which begins on June 28. We've asked the Mufti of the Republic to cancel this year's festival as there isn't enough production. We can only cover half the demand given that we only have 650,000 sheep, not even 1.1 or 1.2 million sheep. In addition, prices are very high. We should bear the responsibility for this. This year, like so many other consumer products, the price of sacrificial mutton has risen to at least $350 more than double the minimum wage in this Maghreb country. The price of sheep is between $500 and $200, and the very high cost of hay pushes up the prices of sheep considerably, which in turn impacts the consumer's purchasing power. Prices are a little more expensive this year, and people aren't in a position to pay, but we are trying to find lower prices. Tunisia, which is indebted to a tune of 80% of its GDP, obtained an agreement in principle from the International Monetary Fund IMF in October for a loan of nearly $2 billion, but discussions have since stalled due to lack of a firm commitment from the country to implement a reform program.